Welcome back to another day of 12 Days of Christmas with Queen of the South. Today I'm joined with Paula That's and good. Donna, Hi. who do the catering at Queen's. So we're going to find out about a bit about them and a bit about the first team's eating habits, I believe. So I'm going to ask you, the first question I'm going to ask, how long have you been at Queen's doing catering? Six years. Six years? Six years past. And yeah. you're both sisters? Yes. Yeah. Don't I'm, really I'm like each other, but you're the eldest. I don't get a lot of respect. I'm the youngest one, but I am the oldest. You're the oldest. Yeah. Right. I'm a baby, Dan. Youngest. <laughs> so what I'm gonna ask is, you feed the players regularly. Yeah. After games and whenever they come here, who's the greediest? Who eats the most? Yeah, muchness. To be perfectly honest, he actually gets the likes of Stephen Dobie bringing his own because he has salmon. Dobie um, likes a big plate for you. Likes is that what you call him? Incredibly Dalza. Chris Higgins. Mm -hmm. um, Mark Miller is a bit fussy. He doesn't like chunks of tomatoes in his pasta. Oh, so, so you've got a fussy bunch. So you've got, got to sort that yeah, all out. We've got uh, yeah, oh. we've got to sort of cater all needs. Got to accommodate for them all, Dan. Mm -hmm. Some like butter on the bread. Some don't like butter on the bread. Yeah. So you know the players. Right, so the twelve days of Christmas, the first a cappella thing in this <laughs> <laughs> karaoke with the two best voices. <laughs> One, two. On the first day of Christmas, my true love sent to me a partridge in a pear tree. The second day of Christmas, my true love sent to me two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree. On the fifth day of Christmas, my true love sent to me five gold rings. Four calling birds, friends, hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the eighth day of Christmas, my true love said to me, Eight maids and milk and seven girls are swimming, six geese are laying, five gold rings. Four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. <laughs> but true love said to me, nine ladies dancing, eight meats of milk, and seven swans are swimming, six geese are laying, five gold rings. Four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Day of Christmas, my true love said to me, Twelve are drumming, and I pass piping, let it loop and nine ladies dancing, eight seven swans are swimming, six geese are laying, five gold rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Can we go in there? Do you have a favourite player? Uh, do you know what? See, since we've been here, there's been a lot of players that's came and went, and <laughs> they're all been all very nice. pleasant to us. They've all, all been all very nice. nice. So no favourite. They all come up and they talk. Jamie Hamill's one of the newer ones, and he's very pleasant, he's very lovely. nice. Yeah. He's lovely. Jamie's lovely. But they are. He doesn't pass you by. Matt Miller, he's lovely. He's a hoot. Uh, he's a uh, laugh, uh, a good yeah, laugh. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. He seems quite funny. And then you get me Dan Carmichael who's back in the show now, isn't ah, he? he's back. Aye. He's back. Mm -hmm. we'll he he pretends he's a wee quiet thing, but he's no. No? No, no. 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 We Dan's been to my bit for cake and tea. Right, next question I'm going to ask, who's the messiest? They're all a bit messy, Dan. Do they leave a mess You're, behind them? The, the, yes, yes, <laughs> very much so. The, I think we've done kids' parties where there's been less mess. Aye? Mm-hmm, aye. So what, what, what's the mess? Just food everywhere? Or aye, just... a couple of their cups. They just leave it. They've, they've got a bit better, to be honest. Fair, Jim has made them bring some of their plates and things up to the kitchen. Oh, and so Jim's got them sorted. Yes, yeah, Jim's kind of got, got them sorted aye. a wee bit. Um, but if Jim's no there, they just won't leave it. Unless they want a sweetie, they'll bring their plate. Know, it's come and bring it and swap for a Mars bar. You the odd one with six or seven plates mm -hmm. at one time. So, oh. but no. I don't like the next one. It's a classic, like... Oh 
<laughs> I, I don't know. know if it goes with your Scottish colour of hair though, Daniel. Ah, so my ginger, it might clash a little bit, but yeah. it is lovely, isn't it? This they're, is the uh, Daniel, warm up they'll top. They'll see you in the dark. They'll see you. You can go running in it. You can go running in it. See me you everywhere. Can, when, it, when you're in charge, I think you can get this in the arena, in the shop, where Steph and Stacey is. Yes, Am I right, Daniel? Donna. Yes, Daniel. Yeah. <laughs> I was just trying to show Daniel that he oh, did no, love no, 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 and, no, 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 Daniel in his kilt, but I can't find a full picture, but that's him in the top half, or just in his kilt. So he does like up in Scotland very much. Oh, well, I will, one sec. But I'm not the way. way. If they tell you that I love you, that I think about you all the time, can I do it Well, this has been Donna and this has been Paula thanks from Light listening. Bites. Oh, thanks for listening. Have a good Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. And a good New Year. See you next year. <laughs>